their family. And they do that like watching and then trying to repeat that by hand. Like I said, it's called observational learning. Another photo opportunity over on the right hand side, we're both the Tina and the Tyra, which we were talking about, and the Leah over here with Jess. Now those squeaks and whistles that you guys are hearing, none of them come from her mouth. Even though Malia's mouth may or may not be open while she's making all of those noises, all of those noises that killer whales make come from the blowhole on the top of their head. The blowhole kind of acts like a balloon. They're, it's basically very muscular. So what they'll do is they'll inflate their lungs with air and they'll use the muscles on the top of their head in that blowhole to manipulate how the air comes out and the vibrations of the muscles. But we as trainers are learning about these animals all the time. In fact, here at SeaWorld, we've been able to learn a lot about these animals that we wouldn't be able to learn just studying them out in the natural environment. Things like road race, for example. We have a killer whale size scale here. In fact, you can see Anna standing on it right now. That big silver platform is a killer whale size scale. What they do is you can ask animals like Kola, that 25 to the 25 year old killer whale, or the lion that was down here on the left hand side, you just slide up on the scale and we can weigh them. So we can start to study how big that they can drink underwater like that, right? One of the reasons that they can do that is that, you know how we can breathe in our mouth and our nose? Uh, killer whales just breathe in through their blowhole or the nostril up on top. So when they're open their mouth underneath the water, they really don't have to worry about that. They're swimming a little bit faster now, right? You may also notice that some of them look like they're swimming with their eyes partially closed, if not all the way. Remember us talking about them relying mostly on sound to find their way? Sometimes in the marine environment, eyesight's not very reliable because the water's murky, a little bit like we see here, it's dark outside. Okay? <laughs> I like sharks. So let me ask you this, just so we're kind of leaving a... Uh, is there anything people your age can do to help killer whales? Yes. So what, what, what could you do to help the killer whale? Mm, or killer whales out in the wild? Guess what we're going to get to do. We're going to get to... How many of y'all ever done like a beach cleanup? Y'all ever done that? I'm going to get Helping to pick up at the beach or some of the stream waterways? Yeah. Come on, Just being careful of what, what we throw away in the trash, right? Because a lot of that stuff ends up in the ocean. We have to be careful. They kind of... Do you know anybody that keeps a garden? Yes. Or you've heard about people putting fertilizer on their lawns. We have to be yeah. careful what kind of chemicals we put on our lawns because once it rains, where's all that poison go? Goes into the water, goes into, goes into the creeks, the rivers, and eventually the ocean. Right? Chemical fertilizer. Now, if we do worm compost, then we're okay. Yeah. Let me ask you this. How many of y'all notice that the killer whales have scratches on their bodies? Did you see that? Yeah. Okay. Look closely at their bodies. Dolphins have the same thing. Those are known as rape marks, and they use their teeth along each other's bodies during uh, play sequences. It's the way also how females discipline their calves. Even the adults will kind of nip at each other a little bit to kind of 
work out the pecking order, so to speak. And with these, they are they are typically female dominated societies. Okay. Yeah, look, just like humans, like humans. <laughs> One of the reasons for that is that the, the females tend to live together for longer periods of time, if not the entire lives. They also live a couple of years and they move on to have different groups of females. Now they're trying to get into the